Hello again. Today we're going to have a look at the Basius Household Pen. Now I don't know why it's called the Household Pen, but with this it's a capacitive touch pen. As you can see it's got capacitive touch end, soft silicon tip, and it's also got a pen inside the other end. And this works perfectly well if you have the original fold, the fold 2, the Z flip, the Z Flip 5G or the Z Flip 3. Now, if you use this with your device, please be careful. It has got a silicon tip, but please still don't press too hard, especially on the older ones, just in case it does any damage. I wouldn't want my suggestion to cause you any harm, so just take this with a, a warning. Right, in the top here, Okay, so in here is you've got a, an extra stylus, a little capacitive touch with a silicon tip, as you can see there. So that's nice of them to supply a, a second one. That's a good result. Right, so I'm not sure which end. I've got Basius branding on here. I'm not sure. Uh, well, yeah, the capacitive touch will be in the, the bottom there. So this must be the pen, and it is. Okay, looks like a nice quality pen. Let's find a piece of paper so that I can test it, see what color it is, and see how it writes. Okay, this should do. Okay, hello. Right, it writes very nicely, black ink, and it's a fine tip as well. So if you're an artist or you like drawing, it would be perfect for that as well. Both of these ends are screw off. That's good as well, so not so easy to lose the cap. And that's a close up of the silicon tip. It doesn't feel that soft, but I'm guessing that it is quite soft. It's very flexible as well. And this just slides across the top of your display. Uh, nowhere to put that, so I'll put that to the side for now. Right, okay, let's have a look at the Samsung Pen app. Right, where is it? Yeah, it works very well. Slides across the screen perfectly. no marks at all not much point me doing a video if it does leave marks and damages the screen no it doesn't now I have used this before on the fold one just to be fair I did a little unboxing but it was more of a fake unboxing I've already used this before and I know that it works fine and it doesn't scratch anything right this is the pen app and on here you can draw pictures or you can color them in and it's quite relaxing and you can make it as easy or as difficult as you want so you can just touch drag to zoom and just touch the individual parts and they change color just like so or you can let's see let's find a different color right we'll do her hair brown and then I'll colour in with a few shadows. Let's get a different darker colour. Okay, let's have a look at the palette. Now in the palette here you can choose various different... There we go, that's got some browns. You can choose different palettes and then they add to the top one here. Right, there it is. Right, so let's get a darker brown. And then if we go to the bottom here... Sorry, if you go there and just touch on that paint can now it will draw instead of fill the color there we go it's got different nibs as well so this one's like a, a semi paintbrush uh, sorry a semi spray can it's not very fine but just as an example okay you can zoom in 
And let's put in a little bit of detail with the ear. Yeah, this is very good. Let's see if that helps. No, it's still coming out as a spray can. Not sure what's going on there. No, that's a definite spray can. All right, let's have a, one more try. Pencil. Okay. No, nope, still coming out as a spray can. Never mind. You get the idea anyway. It works pretty well. And this is on the Z Flip 3. And just going back, I'll show you some of these. These are the ones that I've been coloring in and drawing. As you can see, you can draw things on the side of the the coloring in parts, like the cat I put in, and the ant on that one. Okay, and the pot of sauce on the nuggets and fries. Right, so very good. It's a, a very nice relaxing app. Next up, this is the Samsung Notes app. And so, as you can see, you can... Oh, I've got to put a title. Test. Okay. Now, as you can see, on this one, you can write... Uh, what happened? Oh, it's not on pen. There we go. So, on this one, you can write... Let's try again. There we go. <laughs> and it writes quite nicely. As you can see, my name is... Okay, it was cut off a little bit at the bottom there because of the. It wasn't the crease, it was underneath that for some reason. Right, let's try again with something else. Um, right, let's get a. Let's do a little pink heart. There we go. Don't forget to subscribe. Right, so with this. Let's try another heart. There we go. That's a bit better. And as you can see here, the crease makes no difference to the pen. The same as on the fold. So you don't lose any... You don't lose anything as it goes across. Which is nice. You can use this pen with anything. You can use it with tablets, iPhones. Uh, I'm not sure with an iPhone. You can use it with tablets, Samsung devices, Android devices, because uh, it's capacitive touch. So it should work on our iPhone as well, but I didn't try that one. Right, so there's various different apps that you can use this with. Writing, there's bamboo, paper, which you can do writing as well. Very good. Let me know if you think this is a good idea, if you want the pen for your Z Flip 3, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.